When we launched the MMT in the fall of 2010, we really hoped that there might be 10 or 12 teachers a year who would be interested in the program. Now, six years later, we've had more than 200 teachers graduate from the program and there are about 225 teachers still in the program. In the Centre for Education in Mathematics and Computing, we've always really valued working with teachers, partially because we enjoy working with teachers and partially because of the effect that they then have on their students. Based on the average age of the teachers in the program and the number of teachers through the program so far, we estimate that through this program we've reached about 800,000 students who will be affected by their teachers. The range of teachers has been pretty extraordinary, both geographically, where we've had teachers from 45 different countries in the program, and in terms of gender, where the teachers in the program are almost perfectly balanced between male and female. Well, I've been teaching for, I don't know, 10, 10 to 12 years, and looking back and thinking, I would love to do a master's degree. Um, you find yourself in a situation where you've got a full-time job, you've got a family, uh, who has the time to, uh, to go and do a proper master's degree. And then I found out about the MMT, and I looked at what the program had in it, I looked at who it was designed for, and I thought, there couldn't be anything more perfect than this. I got really excited about mathematics after enrolling in the MMT program. Um, I understood uh, many aspects of which I didn't before, uh, like the history of mathematics, the, the ins and outs of it. And because I got excited about it, I was able to uh, pass it on to, to my kids, uh, especially in the math club or in my regular teaching. I think I would absolutely recommend it to anybody. Um, it's a great opportunity to connect with other like-minded people and uh, it was a great experience all around. What we have now is we have a program that I think has met not only the needs of the individual students, but it's also met our goals, which is to produce a cohort of teachers that are much more prepared to go forward and be leaders in STEM education 